Hey everyone, welcome once again to our daily devotion. This is day 19 of our spiritual journey, Journey to the Promise. And today's devotion is give with great expectation. And when we think about giving with expectation, it is not saying that our motives are to give in order to get back. But there's a wonderful promise in Luke the 6th chapter, verse 38, that spells out how we will receive. So when we do give, when we give generously, when we give according to God's biblical standard, when we become truly biblical givers, there is an expectation that God will measure back to us. It will be good measure, pressed down, shaken together and running over that he will use men to give back into our bosom, that he would bless us according to what we have done and what we have sown. So as believers, we are to give generously in our time and in our prayer and and even in our finances along with our service because we realize that we are not the source, that God is the source. We, We don't depend on our own selves. We are not our own. We've been bought with a price, the price of his blood, and we belong to him. And so everything that we receive from God, we it, literally we're getting it on loan. We are good stewards of what he's given us while we're here on this earth. So He, we understand that he has given it to us that we may be a blessing to others. But when we learn sacrificial generosity and we do it in his name, there will be overflowing blessings both spiritual and physical, that will come back to us. So we have that great expectation that if I do this, God will do this because God will honor his word. So we understand that God's principle of reciprocity is activated when we minister to others by meeting their need, by giving to them, by um, taking care of the church, the house of God, and the people of God. Um, and he, when we do this, he will always raise up other people to minister to us the same way we have ministered to them. So if you're praying for someone, trust me, God has someone praying for you. If you are serving in the church, God will make sure and meeting needs, God will make sure that someone is serving you. If you are looking out for other people's children in prayer and in service and in ministry, even financially, God will make sure that even your children are taken care of. This is the law of reciprocity. This is what God does. This is who he is, that he will give and continue to give and continue to meet out according to what we have given. So as you give, um, of course, our motives are not to give to get back. We don't have this instant gratification mentality, but we do know that God will honor his word and that he will give back to us good measure, pressed down, shaken together and running over. So remember that. And as you do and as you give and as you serve and as you pray and as you give of your resources and take care of the house of God, do it with great expectation that God will reward you over abundantly according to all he can do and according to the power that worketh in us and according to his riches and glory that by Christ Jesus. God bless you. I pray that this has been a blessing to you. Remember, continue your spiritual commitment. Do your one to one to one Spend time with the master today in your prayer and in your word and giving up some activity or giving up a meal or giving up something that use that time to draw closer to him. I guarantee you, you will be blessed for it. Again, God bless you. Have a wonderful day. Stay safe.